Hi guys, in this video, I will show you how to create this asymmetrical ponytail using French and Dutch braids. I start by creating the part lines and first I need a rectangle on top and then I create the curvy shape to the side. For the curvy shape, I create the Dutch braid using the lace braid technique. So Take three strands and start the braid, bringing strands from sides under to the middle and then continue braiding by adding hair from the front to backwards so right under, left under, add hair right under, left under, add hair right under, left under, add hair right under, left under, add hair. Keep on repeating this pattern until you braided the whole section in. Next, I will take some hair from the both sides of the rest of the rectangle. These strands will be braided and the rest of the hair that will leave on the middle will stay on that way. Okay, so then I spray some water and start braiding from the front three strands and then I bring the strands from the sides over to the middle and add hair from the both sides of the braid. From those strands I left out for this braid. So add hair right over add hair left over add hair right over Add hair and left over, add hair. As you can see that I strands I'm adding in are coming over the section on the middle that just lays down there. So this is the fun way to make a simple French braid look a little bit different than usual. Keep on braiding like this until you braided the both sections in. Next I will create the braids to the sides. I spray some water again. Take three strands from the front and then I just braid simple Dutch braid, add hair from both sides and yeah, just a simple braid on the side so the rest of the hair that leaves on the side won't be on my face during the day so I just prefer to do these braids on both sides because that doesn't take that much time but it's definitely more practical than what it would be if the hair would leave just normally and I would pull them back to the ponytail because I have short baby hair on the front that they just don't keep up even if I would do nearly anything because I can't use hairspray so this is the great way to make the hair keep up the whole day and usually also the second.
and here's the final result of this hairstyle. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If you liked, please hit the thumbs up for this video and subscribe my channel. Have a great day and happy prating!